by the clack smack cracking of my thumbs, something wicked this way comes. I don't remember seeing you on the guest list for the dinner party. We're having a rap party for the misfits about 40 years late. Cast and crew only, boss. Come on out, boys. I won't bite. Maybe I'm in your head. Uh-oh. You might have picked up one of those psychoses so common to new kindred. You don't sound anything like the voice in my head. Maybe I killed the voice in your head, boss. No! I was just getting used to that voice. Tell me, the voice in your head, why are you down here? You can trust me, boss. If you're already in my head, then you already know. Uh, you tell me. Think carefully. Who are you here for, and why? Hehe, <laughs> you are him. Good joke. Come out, let's play. You lost, boss. As always. I'll show you the cards I've been dealt. But you put yours on the table first. I've got a nines, a jack, and a prince. And you were about to deal me a queen. You may be on to something, boss. Or maybe you're still talking to yourself. Insanity isn't given enough credit. The insane know not what they do. Do you? Where are you? I'm over here, boss. Wait, maybe I'm over here. Or maybe I'm behind you with a hatchet in my hand. Or did you ever stop to think that your fear, if given a voice, would sound like this? The more I hear you, voice, the more I want to mute you. Let me see you. Oh, yes. Why don't I do that? You got a brain rattling around in that head of yours? Or is it just ornamental? You want something? <laughs> I don't know, boss. You tell me. After all, I didn't crash your party. I'm here for that old box. You don't say. Wake up, boss. Who do you think you're dealing with? Why else would LaCroix send you on his snipe hunt? Oh, that's right. I know you work for the Prince. Why do you ask answered questions? Because I like the sound of my own voice. It's not every day we get visitors, boss. I needed to hear it from you. You're a long way from home, and neither the Prince, nor Isaac, nor Nimes have any domain down here. Tread carefully. Tell me the tale of the box. You should have got here sooner. That lot's been sold. So you have a copy of the receipt? I like to discuss business face to face. I enjoy hideous once in a while. Are you sure, boss? You don't want my image in your subconscious. It's the stuff nightmares are made of. Yes. Careful what you wait behind you, boss. Boss. Oh. An interesting face. <laughs> Quite atrocious, isn't it? I like looking at it in the mirror. Builds character. What is your name, face? What? You don't recognize me from the pictures? Gorgeous Gary Golden? Don't tell me you missed Pirate Town or Tap Hotel. A little before your time, eh, boss? Well, those days are long past. Nowadays, it's just... Gary. Charmed. The box? Where, where, where did it go? That thing seems to get around more than Mae West. Why might I ask, should I give you that information? Some guy in the tower asked me to find it. I don't know. Oh, is he still calling the shots upstairs? How long do you think that will last? Heard he was furious. Wish I could have been there. Well, I'll be a sport. 
I know where your prince's prize is. There's very little that doesn't leak down into this place. Tell me, boss, you ever gone up against a Kuei Jin? Maybe. Those are things that come out of holes that you hit with a hammer? The Kuei Jin are vampires, but not like kindred. Sometimes known as the vampires of the East. But they ain't kin, boss. They're just someone else that, if you ain't being careful, might give you the final death. I'm supposed to be rescuing the box. Even for old Gary, there ain't much more to tell. You see, I sent an agent, Barabbas, to snoop around Chinatown, do a little hacking, make a few contacts. But he hasn't been calling lately, and it's breaking my heart. Why are the words never what I want to hear? <laughs> Welcome to Undeath, boss. Aided a hoot. You up for a little trip to Chinatown? You're in no danger there. Me. <laughs> Best you don't mention my name there, boss. That's the going rate for my info right now. You get our chum back from Chinatown, I'll give you what you need. What must I subject myself to? The Golden Temple in Chinatown. It's a piss poor copy of a real place. Looks like it'd be more at home in a theme park. That I saw is where you'll find the leader of the LA Kuei Jin. They call her Ming Zhao. Sounds dangerous? No, this ain't a suicide mission, boss. You'll be more of a curiosity than a threat. Talk to Zhao. Ask her where my boy is and get him back. Once he's safe, I'll tell you everything you need to know about the sarcophagus. How do I enter the minefield without getting blown up? Let's see what I got. Use your head and your eyes. Chinatown's more liable to offer you than ten Hollywoods. But not if you're smart. Why doesn't your voice sound there? Forget it, boss. It's Chinatown. Sounds dangerous. Got anything I can use to protect myself? Let's see what I got. Use your head and your eyes. Chinatown's more liable to offer you than ten Hollywoods. But not if you're smart. Hmm, I will go to China, but not, do not cross me, voice. Of course. What kind of a monster do you take me for? <laughs> there is a method to my madness, boss. There's a payphone in Chinatown. I'll call you with the info once Barabbas is safe. Until then... You'll never know where I am. I am done before it began. Miss me, boss? Oh, incredibly, sir. Uh, yeah. It's... Gary is weird. And, of course, being that he is higher ranking than us, he gets to tell us what to do. And we have to go do it because we have no choice. Yeah, it's the story of this entire game. Ugh. And the tabletop was about the same though. Uh always getting bossed around by everybody. Jack was right about that. <laughs> Get bossed around by everybody with a weak more seniority than you. But uh now we don't have to come to the sewers anymore because we have this nice little entrance. It's a little side entrance out here in the graveyard, which you should recognize this building from the earlier uh, video, actually. Yep. See? There was a secret passage all along. We never even had to go through the sewers. Isn't that fun? It's fun, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, yes. That's great. Oh, crap. Uh, let me see if I can, uh... Uh, if there's a quest I can do where I can go talk to, uh... Go back and talk to, uh, the Baron. Hmm... Nope, nope, nope. Okay. I guess I don't have to go back and talk to him and tell him what happened. Yeah, he was pretty interested before, I thought, but, uh... Eh, whatever. 
Whatever. It's cool. It's cool, man. Anyways, um, I know I said the videos have been all talking, but you know that <laughs> it's a RPG, man. Every now and then, it's gonna be just a bunch of talking. And honestly, I think there was more than enough action in the last couple of sets of videos to uh, keep you keep you occupied. And then a little bit of talking never hurt anybody. Okay. Any case, I'm going to uh, come out to the taxi cab. And then I will save it, and I will consider which quest to do next. I really need to get back on Eternal Darkness, so I'll probably be doing that next. So see you then.